Hello and welcome to the Kotlin uh, programming tutorial course. Uh, before the introduction of Kotlin, let me introduce myself. Uh, my name is Muhammad Abid, also known as Abidroid, and this is my channel IntelliLogix, uh, offering different courses such as Java, Android, and now Kotlin. So, if you haven't subscribed yet, kindly hit the subscribe button and share with your friends. Now let's come towards the introduction of Kotlin. Uh, what is Kotlin? Kotlin is basically a programming language. Work on this Kotlin language started in 2010, uh, developed by JetBrains. Uh, JetBrains is the company that created IntelliJ IDEA. And uh, if you are familiar with Android Studio, Android Studio is also based on this IntelliJ IDEA IDE. Uh, Kotlin is an open source language. It is a statically typed language. Uh, it targets JVM uh, and JavaScript. Uh, JVM means Java Virtual Machine. So uh, basically Kotlin is based on Java. Uh, it was first released on 15th February 2016. Uh, and where can I use Kotlin? So in Google I.O. 2017, Google announced Kotlin as the official language for Android. It means that you can write Android apps in Kotlin language now. Uh, prior to Kotlin, uh, uh, we were uh, using Java for writing Android apps. Still, you can write uh, Android apps in, in Java, but uh, I am sure uh, in the near future, most of the developers will switch to Kotlin. Uh, so it is good time to learn Kotlin now. Uh, as I said, it will mostly be used for Android app development. You can use it anywhere. It is not limited to uh, Android apps. You can use it uh, on a web you can make uh, desktop applications with it and you can use it anywhere where you can use java it means you can use kotlin as well uh, kotlin is similar to java c sharp javascript groovy uh, but it is mostly uh, i think it is similar to swift uh, if you are familiar with swift that is the programming language used for ios uh, uh, iOS development, iPhone app development. So similarly, Kotlin. Now you can use Kotlin for Android app development. Uh, how can we use Kotlin? So there are various ways that you can use. You can use various IDEs. Uh, you can also use the command line where you can compile and then run your Kotlin programs. You can use IntelliJ IDEA. That is an IDE provided by JetBrains. Uh, you can use Android Studio, you can use Eclipse, you can use uh, uh, NetBeans. Throughout this course, we will be using IntelliJ IDEA as it, uh, uh, it is good to use IntelliJ IDEA. You can use any of these IDEs, but I will prefer IntelliJ IDEA. So this is just the introduction to Kotlin and in the ne uh, next lecture we will learn how to set up the environment, what softwares we have to install in order to run our Kotlin programs. So see you in the next lecture.